Hi, um, my name is Mrs Price and I'm the head of the Creative Technologies Faculty and I'm here today to talk to you about your option choices for all the subjects that are in my faculty. Okay, so first of all, um, I'm going to talk about ICT. We actually do the Cambridge Eye Media qualification and it consists of four units. One unit is externally assessed, which is an exam, and that's 25% of the course. Um, and the exam is an hour and 15 minutes. And the other three units are all coursework. Um, the first unit for coursework is the um, pre-production documents. That's creating all the different documents that you would make before you created like a website or a, um, a movie. And uh, the second unit is a website unit. So you're going to be getting to create a website um, and all the components that go on there, animation, sound, videos. Um, and then the last unit we do is a comic strip unit. So you have to design the storyboard, create the comic strip and evaluate. It's um, a very um, high um, amount of coursework because the exam is only 25%. So we do set strict deadlines for when the coursework has to be um, completed for. Um, this course will give you the opportunity into lots of um, uh, different types of jobs in ICT. Um, um, they actually, can, you can do stuff like um, uh, technicians, um, credit analysis. Um, I mean, you can even go in the armed forces. There's loads of different opportunities for you to use this qualification for. And then, you, if you want to at college, you can take the level three or go straight into an A level in ICT. Computer science then, um, it's made up of two components. Um, it's uh, computer systems, which is applying academic principles from the classroom into real world systems, and it's and it exciting and engaging. Um, the second uh, component is computational thinking. That's all about algorithms and programming, and this is going to help you develop skills to solve problems, to design systems, and understand uh, human and machine intelligence. Now, um, because both of the components together, um, each are 50%, the whole qualification is 100% exam. Um, they, uh, the students will be um, looking at future jobs in computer science, in computing and computer science, and uh, they are the amongst the highest paid jobs at the moment and provide a lot of job satisfaction. And the uh, examining body that we um, use to deliver this course is OCR. Business studies. Um, business studies is a mixture of coursework and um, external examination. Now, there are two components for the coursework. Um, they are exploring enterprises and um, planning and pitching and evaluating an enterprise. And the exam is about marketing and finance. It's two hours and it's a written paper. Now, um, this course is um, uh, helps you to prepare for the world of business and enterprise and develop skills for further education and employment. It's highly, highly practical, which means you get to design and run your own business and help to raise money for charity or for a cause of your choice. Um, the actual awarding body for this is Pearson and um, it's beneficial for careers such as accounting law, business management and even running your own business. Um, life skills. So life skills is a qualification which um, will be beneficial um, to a lot of future careers and a range of professions. The skills that you will learn if you choose life skills will be teamwork, leadership, uh, money management, communication and all of these are vital in future careers. Now this is 100% um, coursework, there's no exam, so you gather and build up a portfolio of evidence uh, based around nine modules. Those modules are earning and spending money, um, keeping track of your money, making financial choices, a place of your own, health and well-being, cooking on a budget, practical cooking skills, career management and preparing for the world of work. Um, th this course is um, enabling students to become more independent. Okay, engineering. So engineering has two parts. It's 40% uh, exam and 60% coursework. Um, the exam is about understanding the world of engineering and the coursework is all the skills and techniques that you need to learn around about engineering. Now, the type of skills um, that it covers are engineering disciplines, um, the science and mathematics applied in engineering, how to read engineering drawings, uh, the properties and characteristics of engineering materials and knowing why specific materials are selected for spe specific engineering applications, um, engineering tools, equipment and machinery, 
um, produ production planning techniques, uh, processing skills and techniques that are applied to materials and manufacturing task equipment. Um, possible um, courses after this would be A-level engineering or an A-level in design technology and the possible careers would be electrical engineering, fabrication, gas, civil engineering and automotive engineering and the award body is the NCFE. Uh, design technology. Um, so this course is 50% exam, 50% coursework. So um, the coursework itself is a design ch challenge. So you have to analyse, design, implement, test and evaluate throughout the whole um, process um, during this course. Um, it can set you up for careers such as um, uh, fashion, engineering, architecture, information technology and even education. Um, other so other um, qualifications can include fashion designer, product designer, architect, carpenter, software engineer, civil engineer. Um, students will get to use uh, modern manufacturing equipment such as a laser cutter and 3D printing techniques and they're all required to use critical thinking um, and uh, this hopefully will lead towards innovation and design um, and making prototypes to solve actual problems, that's the coursework part of it. Um, the awarding body is the AQA and um, the exam itself is, um, like I say, 50% and 15% of that in involves an element of maths. Hospitality and catering. Right, this course is made up of two components. It's 40% exam and 60% 60, 60 coursework. The coursework element is written and it's actually got um, a practical um, part as well, which you have to be um, examined producing um, a, food, uh, for a food dish for a purpose. Um, students will learn to prepare themselves um, and in the environment of cooking. Um, they will look at factors that affect food choice and the selection of food. Um, it will show them how important a balanced diet is um, and also um, show them how to adapt recipes um, to make them healthier. And the main um, one as well is to plan and produce dishes for a given purpose. Um, this is for students who want to work in the hospital hospitality and catering um, sector um, or go on to do further qualifications in that area. Um, it's a very practical course as well which means students need to have good organisational skills and make sure they complete tasks within a given time or to a deadline. The exam board for this is WJEC um, and if you have any more information you can contact Mrs Drew or email her at um, ddrew at cast.coop. Thank you.